I, today I will be reviewing. I'm the guy that lives in your dumpster. Oh, dude, last time we made a video together, I shot you in the arm, probably killed you, and you know, reoccurring characters and such. Well, I didn't die, he, he, thankfully. I just got an infection in my shoulder. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, it's kind of. The doctor told me it's spreading a lot, and yeah. I yeah. might die in a few days. Oh, take a seat before you collapse on the floor and after a bit. Okay, now it'd be dark. Okay, so today we are probably going to review Star Fox, which is a game for Super Nintendo. It, uh, it used to be a Super FX chip. Su not Super FX, not FX. If you say FX, then you are not an MLG swag gamer like me. Dab on him! Sorry, that was a bit spontaneous. Uh, so it was released in 1994. Pretty good game. What are your opinions on it, my shirt? My, it, my friend. It is really great. The, the only... There is a lot of have good good gameplay in it. The graphics, everything's basically a polygon or shape, something like that. The only problem is I'm terrible at it. I agree. So as you're watching the footage now, you may see some pretty cancerous fails. Yeah. They were mainly made by me. And me. Yeah. It's pretty sad. Yeah. But um the storyline is basically you have to kill this one monkey dude. You gotta shoot the face at the end. It's it's physics, bro. Uh, it's the, the story behind Star Fox is that Star Fox's dad was part of this yeah. elite he, uh, space force team, and they they were went out to save everybody. Then they then uh, one of the members on the elite team he uh, said that there's this one place we need to go. So oh they so all four of them went. The that one in elite team betrayed hit the group, killed Star Fox dad. Hit, and Star Fox got the greatest news of all, learning that his his dad died. He so and so uh, Star Fox, Huck, Slippy, E Falcon, and Peppy. And Peppy was uh, one of the, the squad members of the Star Fox, because his dad was like, squad member. And so they, so the four of them go out to uh, save the world, hold and fight this one huge monkey head boss. Heck yeah! Because this game, of course, like any Super Nintendo or really any Nintendo thing, you have to have some sort of ape involved. Like you know, have Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong. I bet Kirby's like a shaped obesity epidemic <laughs> ape. You know, just really all that. So overall, this game is pretty good. I'd probably rate it an 8 out of 10, maybe even 9 out of 10, maybe even 37 out of 29. But that's a little bit too much for it, because, you know, that, go that breaks the laws of rating. So, Metacritic, don't sue us. 